Lost in Hollywood action body bag. That was so lame. But hey, this one's got Tobias on here from X Novelist. These guys are set out to release their first EP after starting this band online for everybody. And they're going to be starting to play some shows in Germany. So let us know what you guys thought about this song in the comments. All their links are down in the description below. Go show them some love. Let's see what they got. I put myself in a body bag. Suicidal thoughts running through my head. Yep. I run away, but it never ends. To bother me that I will never be okay. Oh, we are not okay. Woo. Bends. I don't know what to believe, but I know it is me. I am the broken one. Ooh. I put myself in a body bag. I love how you went out there. Nice melody. It's catchy. My forever breakdown. I'm gonna need a forever breakdown if you're gonna toss out lyrics like that. Nobody seems to believe, cause nobody sees broken and shattered mind. I love the readiness of the guitar parts during this stuff. But I can't escape the light. Can you But where the where are the screams now? Yeah. I put myself in a body bag. Suicidal thoughts went into my head. Okay. Put myself in a body bag. Suicidal thoughts went into my head. Very sing along, you. Okay. We need a breakdown with screams. Oh, okay. We got Tobias coming back in. Let's go. This is my forever breakup. Bravo. Thank you. Hold the fuck up. Ah, wait. I screamed it out of my loss until I turned. Fuck. I have a place to know. It's just a fucking lie. Ah. Uh. This is a fucking lie. Well, let's go back to that break. That was long, first and foremost, but I was not expecting that. Great build up. Call out. This is my an this my is anthem. <laughs> I wanted the snack. I didn't know what to do. Ugh. That part's cool. <sighs> Take it in again. Yeah. Bravo. Oh, it's my forever breakdown. <laughs> I put myself in a body bag. This shit. This is a cool structure on this song, too. Put myself in a body bag. Very catchy. Give me some chunk on the end. That's more than chunk. One more black. Mmm. Wow. I called that breakdown on the end of there. I'm like, fuck, it needs another chunky spot in there. Um, shit. This is good. This is good for a band just starting off as like an internet band i thought that was just really cool i didn't realize there that they were like that i've heard the name be tossed around there and there there and there um but i've kind of recognized uh the vocalist here tobias uh from the novel or sorry from novelist uh it's been a minute since i've heard it so i had the one spot there at the beginning i thought that was a lead singer to a degree so i don't know too much on them 
but I really did enjoy this song. I wanted a little bit more screams throughout it, but honestly, it wasn't too bad. Like the vocal style on there, if it, if it didn't start with the screams at the beginning, I probably would have been a little bit more like I wouldn't have cared for it. But when I heard those screams, I was kind of waiting for it to come kind of come back in. It could have probably just maybe in the verse, the second verse, maybe going into the breakdown, maybe some light screams underneath it just to kind of separate it and make it a little bit more different. But that's the only thing I would even say to change if there was like if I had any control of that, <laughs> of that stuff. But other than that, beginning of the song, man, this is uh, a great intro. Uh, I love like those little levels that were kind of like going up with the song and kind of progressing with it. Uh, Tobias was like screaming out the, the intro of that, which I thought was really cool. Kind of everything coming in with the different levels and guitar tones on those guitars and kind of went and then smoothly transitioned into like that bouncy kind of riffy verse stuff. Then it just kind of jumped into the cleans, which, uh, which was really good. I kind of expected a little bit more of the verse. More on the course for the cleans, but again, I didn't really know what we were going to get into on this one. But the cleans were good. Honestly, uh, when we were walking into it, it was good. It was it had like a really cool, maybe like issues vibes in a way, kind of giving you those like, uh, I don't I don't really know what to say, but it wasn't like electronic-y in the background, but just those light chugs in behind there. So it kind of still had those heavy elements along the ride with those little bit of those uh, cleaner, soft-spoken kind of situations. But the course went very well with it as well. Nice transition, put myself in a body bag, very hooky. I mean, they kind of repeated a lot on this one. You can sing along with it by the end of the song and enjoy it as well. So really enjoyed those, nice breakdown, but I definitely wanted a little bit more screams on that throughout the song, which I've already kind of told you guys. Let's talk about the breakdown because the breakdown was awesome. Honestly, when I first heard the little bit of the lyric in this song, you know, my forever breakdown, I'm like, okay, if they don't spin this special lyric, Eric here that I want into a bluff breakdown. Like, oh, hell is going to fucking break loose. Fucking Bravo. I didn't even know what to do. I'm like, I was expecting them not to put a black in it because I just feel like things don't work out in the way that I want them to work out when it comes to that stuff. So great build up into that. My forever breakdown. That was speaking my language hard there. Let us know if that was perfect for you guys as well. Love the chunk on the guitars, the floatiness in that breakdown. Just beautiful. Rolling back into the cleans as well. Just a really cool structure in a way. When you come to think about it you know i had those screams at the beginning didn't hear them until like the breakdown but they also made a really good point of keeping it a little bit heavy on the end as well so with that little nasty breakdown beautiful beautiful honestly i really enjoyed this one i don't know what i would rate this one but like on the melody side of things very catchy very good for like marketing uh and to hook people into checking out some more of the music which i hope you guys are going to do right after this video again guys all their links are down in the description below make sure you go give them a follow stream this song put it on your playlist and let us know down in the comments what you guys saw that made it on your playlist what changes would you make on this one is there any changes did you enjoy how much cleans there are versus screams i don't know but if you don't want to do any of those those things that I just said, there's some new bands in this playlist here that you need to go check out.